Welcome to Buyer Hold Review and Processing. First, what is Buyer Hold? It is a setting at the supplier level that keeps purchase orders to the supplier from emailing until after a buyer has reviewed and manually released the order. The setting is located under the supplier, under PO transmission, and states whether hold POs for buyer review. If this is set to no, it will follow the prompts above. If it is set to yes, it will hold all transmissions until a buyer has reviewed. This setting is managed by the e-procurement team, so any change requests would need to be sent to them. And remember, any request at the supplier level must be applicable to all Pinnacle properties, not just yours. So what are the benefits of buyer hold? First, the purchase orders will be held for additional information needed, such as deposits and reversals. Second, it allows us to change the contact information in the system before the email is sent to the supplier. This is particularly valuable for suppliers that do not have one centralized contact for all Pinnacle Entertainment. The setting will give each property the ability to put their specific contact email into the system before the purchase order is sent. There's a hint here. So under PO transmission, if I'm looking at my supplier, if my buyer hold POs for review is set to yes, and the PO transmission method is sent to email, it is likely that you will be required to do a deposit due to the high number of deposits this supplier has. If the PO method is set to prompt, it is likely you will be asked to provide your property's contact email information when you send the PO, as this particular supplier most likely does not have a single point of contact for Pinnacle Entertainment. So what are the risks of buyer hold? Well, the risks is all buyers in the company see all purchase orders on buyer hold and are able to release them, sometimes without proper review. So how do we mitigate that risk? We go under our names, under settings, to notifications, and we scroll down to orders. Under orders, there's a notification, unorder is on buyer hold. I want to make sure both of these settings are turned to off. This will keep the system from sending me notifications on buyer hold that do not belong to me or my property. How I want to manage buyer holds is not through this setting, so it's turned off, it's actually through a view field and a scheduled email. So if I scroll up and I go to orders, I want to find the view field that pertains to my property, select it, and it will show me all of my purchase orders on buyer hold. This view field should be checked and cleared daily. If I don't want to manually check this view field every day, I can schedule an email and send it to myself. So I can send it daily, I can send it first thing in the morning, and if it's empty, I don't want to see it. That way, if I don't have anything on buyer hold, the system will not prompt me to take action, and the minute something pops up in this view field, it will email me the next morning. So once I find an order that I should clear, how do I clear it? Well, the first thing I need to know is I need to find some information about my purchase order. So I'm going to select my purchase order number, and the first thing I'm going to check is if a deposit is required. If a deposit is required, I know that I need to add a deposit and a reversal line. If it's no, then more than likely, this either just needs to be sent because the vendor usually asks for a deposit and it's just on buy or hold. In that case, when I hit send, it will send it out. If this needs to be held for email review, it will pop up an additional screen and allow me to change the email. When I hit send, if it automatically sends, that means that this particular vendor has a contact email in the system that is applicable to all of Pinnacle Entertainment. If it is not that way, when I click into the purchase order and I know that there is not a deposit required, I scroll to the bottom and hit send, it will prompt me for correct contact information. I would then add it here. As soon as I've added it, I will hit OK, and I will send it the way it should be sent. 
So that is buyer hold review and processing.